Alright guys, today we're going to be unboxing this box from MBRP, or is that right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, just want to make sure. They make a lot of parts for cars and trucks and a lot of things, and we got something really special in this box, so let's go ahead and open it. Heck yeah. <laughs> So, right here, we have the box. It's really special. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Um, it is a fun channel. We do a lot of things. Filmmaking, short films, YouTube videos, promos, a whole bunch of stuff. Please check out our channel. I'll leave the link in the description. But, off on the jabbering, let's open this sucker up. Right up. I'm so excited for this. Literally, like yesterday. It is a muffler. Oh, here's the beauty herself. Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, look how cool that is. It's got a yeah. engraved logo on it. Yeah, isn't that sweet? That's sick. We got an unboxing. <laughs> oh, oh, look how Holy beautiful. God. It's so shiny. It's like Christmas. It's beautiful. I'm just going to leave it in the box. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's beautiful. I don't know if you can tell, it's got an MBRP there. Yeah. Beautiful chrome. Honestly, their products are amazing. I actually got this from a website called Real Truck, uh, which is kind of funny because you would think, oh, it's for a truck. No, this was on there as for a Bronco Sport. I'm just going to put it right here. Uh, if you guys want to get this for yourself or your own Bronco Sport, I really suggest it because I've heard some great things about it. I leave a link down in the description for that. And a nice little instructions. So we'll just put that right there. Yeah, overall, it's a great product. I mean, look at this bad boy. He is heavy. That would suck. <laughs> so from one to ten, what is like your excitement on this? Yeah, I mean, how excited are you? I'm I'm pretty excited. I'd say like a ten out of ten. I mean, yeah, like a ten out of ten because this is a three cylinder, am I correct? Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a three cylinder and I've never heard anything like that before. I don't know if you guys have ever heard anything like that before. So honestly, I think we're gonna get like the first sound. Like I don't I don't know anybody that has ever done anything like this. So I'm really excited to tear into it and kind of just see what it sounds like. This is the Big Ben edition. We've done so many promos with it. If you have seen our channel, we've been on for a while. We just barely did a promo with it. So go, at, go check that out. But anyway, let's get, let's get started. This is serious. Mr. Magoo, what's uh, what's going on over here? You know, uh, all right. Looks like you're measuring it, but I'm not too sure. Yep. So what we just did, um, we just cut all of the the clamps off for the heat shield, so we can uh, cut the rest of this pipe. We just hit the directions say measure 17 and a quarter inches. So we just mark that, and then we're gonna cut it, and then we'll just be able to take the back end of this muffler, slide it right out, and then we'll be able to put our new one in, just as easy as that. Okay, so just really quick, I wanted to give a huge shout out to Amelia Hartford for making the first ever Bronco straight pipe, but not the Bronco Sport straight pipe. That's the difference between mine and hers, is mine's a Bronco Sport and hers is a Bronco. Also, I want to give another huge shout out to MBRP for their first straight pipe Bronco Sport. And the difference between mine and theirs is theirs was a 2.5 liter and I did the 1.5 liter. So yes, I am the first person to ever do a Bronco Sport straight pipe and exhaust mod on a 1.5 liter Bronco Sport engine. After long hours, me and Mr. Magoo are in the car, finally having the muffler on. And goodness gravy, it sounds really good. Mr. Magoo, we gotta tell you thanks for making this possible because I am not smart. <laughs> Holy, literally making this all happen. But we got it, and it sounds really good. So we're gonna record some stuff, hoping that it sounds delicious and fine to the ears of you guys at home or wherever you might be watching this video right now. 
It just sounds so good though. Oh man. Holy it's so it's so much deeper than and factory. It shifts too. Like it, it's like you know it really is in there too. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I can't believe it. It sounds so good. And now we're gonna put it in sport mode. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude! That's awesome. What? Who would have thought that? Because like usually like a V8 would sound a lot deeper and more rumble, and usually like a V4 is more like a high pitched noise. Well, this is a three cylinder, and it sounds pretty close to an eight cylinder. Yeah. Like it's pretty deep. It's got it a is nice. So weird. It's got a nice rumble to it. And especially it, when it idles, it's like a really just boop, 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 like, like it's just really low. It's crazy. Which, is, which really I didn't think it would be that way. Yeah, but. and being for a 1.5 liter engine, I mean, who would have thought? Oh my. Wow! <laughs> Dude, I wonder what this sounds like under a tunnel. Ooh. We gotta try that. I still can't get over it. <laughs> it's just, it's so good. It's, it is literally so good. It's almost like a sports car now. Yeah. It's not an SUV, it's not an off-road vehicle. It could be, but now it's, it's literally a sport vehicle with an off-roading vehicle. Yeah, I think you guys are now just gonna have to subscribe. You're gonna have to like this video. Mr. E spent a lot of good, hard work, money put into this. <laughs> he put a lot of money into this. We both put a lot of good hard work into this for you guys so you could hear it, so we could hear it, so the world could hear it. So a like would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> oh. That sounds so good. I don't know if you guys can hear it as good as I can hear it, but it sounds so good. That sounds so awesome. All right, this is my reaction. Oh boy, here we go. Go ahead. What? Are you serious? What? It sounds too good. Right guys, so we were doing some stuff, came back from a show and stuff, but Mr. Magoo, he's the man, <laughs> put the muffler together, I helped him out. I swear I was not just sitting in a chair letting him do all the work, because this man knows what he's doing. He did help, and it was good, it was a decently easy install, didn't take too long, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, was, it was good, it was fun, and it yeah. turned out great. And turned it was awesome. it was worth it. It was worth it. It was worth it all along. Yep. So guys, that's the end of the video for this unboxing. We haven't done one of these for so long. Yeah, forever. Um, I wish we could do announcements, but if you haven't already, go follow our podcast, and we do all of them there now. Yeah, that's basically the end of the video, and um, anything else you want to say? No, I'm good. Alrighty, guys, hit that subscribe button, and like always, we'll see you next time.